Hi, so you're Mark Potato, welcome to yet another video. Today we're going to be doing a Minecraft mod tutorial for 1.8. So, if you go to this link in the description and click 1.8, then download the source. I'm going to jump right into it, by the way. Download the source and click it again. Because it doesn't load straight away. Click it again. <sighs> and it's going to download that eventually. This this is the source for. So if you want to play modded, you'll normally download installer win or installer. Today we're downloading the source. If you would download. Next, you want to go over to here. This is Java Development Kit 8. Press accept and download this one. If you are 64-bit now, to find out whether you're 64-bit, you go to here. You right-click on compute. You go to computer. You right-click on it. You click on properties, and then you can close that. Then, if you see 64-bit operating system, then you know. So 64-bit 86, which doesn't make any sense. It still hasn't loaded a source. So this is now loading that. So please wait. So wait for it to do it. Three, two, one. Ad focus one. is a revolutionary new no, way of making no, money on really, the internet really, from sharing really links on shut Facebook, up. Twitter, shut up. or YouTube. Shut up. Simply sign up below, share links, and earn money. Now you can close that. I didn't want that advert to be honest. Now we've got the Java development kit downloading, so you can close that as well. Now you want to go get Java, um, Java Eclipse, which is basically what we're gonna. I edit it in and this is how you install it um, okay they recommend the first one I'm unsure which one to do but I recommend download this one I'm 64 bit windows then click download then it'll say thank you for downloading and it'll download that now this is downloading here so this so you want to go to your downloads go these are unconfirmed but on your forge extract files you can do this with the normal one just extract and like that so rename this I'm gonna call it a bit of everything as this is my mod name and then I've got a folder encoding. If I just move that into there and into there, so this this is where it is. So that's still downloading that, and all you gotta do is wait. Click on install. Click on run. So this is loading up. It does take a bit for me to load it up. But click on advanced system settings, environment variables, and make sure you don't press delete. And that's opening up. So Java, let's go home. I'm just sorry if if I'm rushing this a bit. Third attempt. I'm trying to record this. <laughs> so it goes there, and this is ready. Um. Click on the top one, click on install, and that's installing. So you want to, I'm middle mouse clicking to do that uh, thing. So, got this here. So, um, still downloading that, which is taking ages. This is also respond. Hello. Okay, it's installing that. So you want to actually head to your computer, Windows 7, and go to Program Files, Java. Now, wait there. It's got wait for this to download. Shouldn't take too long. And now it's a waiting game. So I'll see you once I'm finished. Okay, so it's downloaded. So let's run this and check on that. That's fine. So wait for it to open. It'll come up with something on the screen, like so. Click yes to that. Uh, yeah, that's fine. 
I like this installer so it's installing it I think that's nearly done so while that's installing got the Java one running so it should now you can close your internet browser and we've actually got Eclipse done so I'm not gonna open that yet okay this one okay so preparing to install now what you want to do is just waiting this is now done now I think this should be a way to access Eclipse so I go to your area and Eclipse Java Mars Eclipse there they go so I'm gonna pin this there and I'm not gonna open that yet like close that but excellent okay launch it this is going to click next um, click next and let that install and whoa I, I haven't seen this before but that looks fancy as hell okay then once that's opening just leave it there and I didn't change this this did it automatically so go back to oh apparently Java's gone I don't know okay so this is fine this has been fine so press cancel you don't want to open that yet so in here we're in program files one of the okay we've got Java here this is copying new files just let us do it extracting the installer and okay nearly ready just let it finish off then we can actually fill in this so you can actually do this now press go onto here and right click copy I know it's still installing but and just right click in between those two and click paste and press ok 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 now that's should be this bit done now let this finish and when it's finished we can actually get on to doing it so while it's just finishing off go back into here right click on any of the files and click open file location don't know what that's doing okay shift right click and click open command window here this is going to open up cmd and type in these exact words grad loop setup decomp okay destination okay this is done click next it's done it so now it's working it's doing its stuff now just leave this to work So I did it, it took about an hour because I had an error the first time I did it and then I had to put it in debug mode so if you want to know how to do debug it's like on the end of it dash dash debug but now you've got that you can actually close this now you've got all of that click click the eclipse wait for it to load up now click browse and then go into your folder so mine's in coding then click on eclipse and press close these then click ok ok and now it's gonna now you're gonna have your mod so wait for it to load shouldn't take too long um, it, for you it wouldn't take an hour to do just 
my internet slow and I was doing other things as well so yeah so it opens up and if you get if you don't see this here that means that you've had a problem now I'm I'm closing a lot of these because I don't like them <laughs> basically putting it in simple words don't like it get rid of it and if I just bring this down and click on this little arrow here and go on to package presentation hierarchical so in here you've got this now you want to right click on this and click delete we're going to code this ourselves now what you want to do is click this icon here which will create a new package then put like your username or like if you have YouTube put your YouTube name so mine is CJ Minecraft then do like your mod name so bit of everything and hit enter then click a new class and then this is going to be your mod name so bit of everything I'll just do this for aesthetics you don't necessarily need it like that but do that and there you go so first thing you want to do is also create a new class called reference and here we're going to create a couple of stuff so we want to create a public static final and it's a string and it's the mod ID and okay that's going to be blank for now I'll change it in a sec so just control C that paste it so we're going to have the name and we're also going to have the version so the version is Minecraft this is 1.0 the name is bit of every so obviously you can fill this in with your own stuff and a mod ID now this normally if it's like a couple three words like mine is I'll do like B O E like bit of everything if it's like one word say chisel just put like chisel the shortened version now control S to save and you go on to hit now underneath press enter do at mod and then if you hover over this import it and press control space maybe maybe not then open up your brackets and then do um oh lot of stuff in here so mod id equals reference dot mod id name equals reference dot name version equals reference dot version okay now in here you want to create some voids which is basically like a normal method so it's a public static void and pre in it and open up these and hit that and press enter so in pre it's going to be a fml pre in press control space and there you go and put event after so that should have imported it here and then what you want to do is go and copy this and paste it two times then just hit enter in between these to make it look good now change this one into in it so just put it like that and get rid of the pre in it and just leave it in it and this one is not going to be pre in it it's going to be post in it and just change this to post now those two will be red press control shift o automatically imports them and there you go so um if you want to just say that your mod is loaded just do in your init method not like that system dot out dot print line and choose the string and then use quotation marks and say a uh, bit of everything in it so that's just saying that you've initialized it so click this icon here run and you'll probably s see it should do something yep console's there I like to minimize this and it goes over here so this is the console so if you took the console out of minecraft you'd get a lot of this stuff so this is setting a player for every time you like reboot eclipse it's gonna
be take like a while to load up like this but the more you do it the fact it'll be like better and fine so if you just wait for this to do it shouldn't take too long I hope there you go so this just says your stuff um, now it will say like um, the package so CG Minecraft a bit of everything dot bit of everything bit of everything in it it will say that and if you look there you go it's initializing the engine and it's about load up game and if we look in here I'm not sure it should be should say in it might not but there you go Minecraft is loaded so create a new word call it test or something I had to put it on super fat and that is going to annoy me so I'm going to turn the music off okay just generate that um, well you can't tell for now that the mods worked but it has it has worked and here we are so I'm just going to sort out my settings so put a peaceful video settings that, that 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 okay and then your Alex now your skin changes every time you do it and you got normal Minecraft but this is in fact modern Minecraft so that is all that I'm gonna do today so I'll see you in the next tutorial